since AMP carries everywhere. Alright, so I think there is a music track that came out with the Revenant's Caves coming out. So I needed to just unlock this real quick. I think I unlocked it. I need to start using my music cape, so I should be able to use it now. Let's check out what this Master Clue got for us. Here we go. Alright. Lots of money, basically. Oh, we got a drop. Alright, here we go. Here we go, guys. Padoodle! Oh, come on, man. All these prayer scrolls, dude. It's always the decks and the augury, but obviously they're the most common ones, but... Man. All these prayer scrolls, dude. That's another one. Oh. Some free space here and there. Oh, got myself a warrior ring. First warrior ring in a long ass time. Also got a D axe earlier, but yeah, it's good. Okay, here we go. <gasps> oh, a drop. Yes, yes. Fuck yes. Ah, awesome, awesome. All right, man. Here we go, guys. Here we go. Well, yo, man, freaking scrolls all the time. I mean, yes. It's expected, you know, scrolls all the time, but yes, can we get, can we just get something a little different, you know, Let, let's mix it up, please, some good old money, alright, another elite clue fresh from the raids, here we go, oh, oh, wow, I thought that was an ornament kit for a second, uh, but okay, you know, it's decent, I guess, decent rewards, I shall take that, oh, I got another, uh, Zami book, basically, I can make, so, that's cool. Oh, another elite clue. Oh my god. Wow. The elite clues are just flying in, dude. It's insane. Insane amount of elite clues. I'll just say another one. Here we go. Oh, wow. Um, Damn, dude. It didn't even reach 100k. Okay. But it's a elite clue, man. What, what else do you expect? Honestly. A fairy ornament kit? No way, dude. So I have finally finished turning all of the sapphires that I cut into the rings. 9,000 of them. Yeah, that's insane. So I was thinking about like enchanting them all, but then I realized, wait, if I enchant them all, it would actually take a really long time and I don't really need, you know, to have all the charges at once. So I'm just going to enchant the sapphire rings as I go. So whenever, you know, my suffering runs close to being out, I'll just enchant like 100, 200 at a time whenever I need them. So now I'm working on the rubies. The amulets, of course, give me the best XP for my buck. So I'm getting about 100k an hour. So that's really, really good experience, you know. So I should be able to get to 97 uh, relatively fast in under 3 hours. Alright guys, so I am still keeping up with my uh, weekly goal of trying to get one crafting level. So it's coming up in about, yeah, right now. 97 crafting guys 90 freaking 7 is there anything I can make at 97 oh well I guess there isn't but two more levels to go man I'm pretty excited actually yeah it's it's a big level coming up 1.1 mil man to 98 I'm gonna try to get this within the week for sure I mean I've used the sapphires and those weren't that good XP but rubies as you know are quite nice I still got 400k uh, crafting speed rubies and emeralds aren't that bad either so I should be able to get to 98 uh, relatively comfortably you know just show afk basically <gasps> oh a drop oh my god yes today is the day boys <sighs> wow. damn bro every time now at this point it just it just gets the beating you know your heart's just beating dude all right, here we go. Here we go, guys. Please. Please be it. Oh my god! Oh my god, a twisted bow! Oh my god! A twisted bow! Oh my god! Oh! Yo! Holy fuck! A twisted bow, dude! Oh, shit! Holy shit! I can't believe this bro, at 2am? Like what? Holy shit! Oh, wow. Oh, wow, dude. Oh, man. 
Holy fuck, like, dude, when people say they're shaking, like, I'm actually fucking shaking a bit, dude. Holy shit! Wow, dude, oh my god, dude. I can't believe this. It actually happened, dude. 1,394 rates later. 45 million points later. Oh my god, dude. I can't believe I, I finished that. I can't believe it, dude. I actually finally got a Tipo. Okay, okay, okay. You know what? I'm, I'm calm down now. I'm putting it here, dude. Next to all the, you know, those super rare items. The most rare items from Raids. Right there. That's that's amazing, dude. Oh, boy. That's it, that's it bro. I just got the most broken and most powerful, probably most iconic equipment currently that exists in this entire game. Wow. I finally possess it. That's, that's just insane, bro. So throughout this grind, a lot of people have asked me, you know, good question, like, what am I gonna do once I get a Twisted Bow? What will I do with it? Well, I'm not done with Rage yet. Even though I have the Twisted Bow, I'm still 14 out of 15. There's still one other item left, the Ancestral Bottoms. I've yet to see it. So just for Rates itself, it's going to be incredibly useful. The Twisted Bow is insanely good at Rates. I will show you, because I'm about to go and, you know, uh, do a few more Rates, of course, with the newly obtained Twisted Bow. It's going to be amazing. And also, a lot of different bosses, even though I have finished most of them, are still subject for me to eventually maybe go back and do some of them. For example, I still do some DKs, you know, while I'm looking for the Gargoyle boss, so it's gonna be amazing there. And future bosses, like Raids 2 bosses, uh, Vorkath maybe, the Dragon boss from Dragon Slayer 2, they can all be game for the Twisted Bow. It's just insane how much my horizons for PVM in, in terms of ease, you know, this Twisted Bow will grant me. Like, it's incredibly powerful, guys and incredibly incredibly useful without a doubt probably the most useful weapon in the entire game and remember those times I showed the dragon arrows look at this shit I've saved up 11,000 dragon arrows from all the raids that I've done pretty much 90 plus percentage all from raids so yeah I'm gonna go destroy some uh, raids real quick with my newly uh, obtained twisted bow thank you very much so for our first raid with the Twisted Bow, we got a Jody room, uh, it looks like mining room, skeleton room, shamans, and meter dial. So, oh my god, let's just do this. I'm just gonna sit back and let my bow just do everything. Like, I'm just kidding. I'm, I'm, I'm still gonna pay attention, but let's just go. Alright, I smoked that. Okay, I just hit a 58 casually. Alright. Can we do more? What the fuck? Oh yeah, I don't even need to go on long range because the uh, Twisted Bow Rapid is already on long range. It's basically long range with a crossbow, so it's insane range, dude. Insane hits. Oh man. Yeah, okay, Ice Demon is so much easier like this. I just walk around and it's dead. What the heck, bro? <laughs> okay, yeah, rates are gonna be really, really chill. I'm like straight up hitting like 50s and 83! 83! Oh my god, what? Wow, I love it. Holy shit, it's already dead. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> Yo, that was like the sloppiest fossa I've done in a while, but hey, it just, it just kicks ass. It's too good, bro. Alright, I just woke up, and it's real, boys. I still got this bow. Now it's time for me to make this video. Oh, man. can't believe it, dude. I'm so freaking excited to get this done.